Now all of the videos that you see on this channel are edited on Premiere Pro. But a lot of times you are asked this question that what are the free alternatives to Premiere Pro? Now I hate to be the bearer of bad news but there aren't many options which offer you great advanced editing features along with no cost or no charges at all. But like I said, there might not be many but it's not like there aren't any. And that's what this video is all about. Today we'll be taking a look at seven of the best video editors for Windows that you can use for basic editing as well as full-fledged advanced editing. So without wasting any time, this is Gaurang, you're watching Guiding Tech, let's get started. All right, so first up is my go-to choice for editing short clips or reels or anything like that. And the best part about this is that it comes pre-installed on Windows 11 and its name is Clipchamp. Clipchamp offers a super easy to use interface that just about anyone can use. It's perfect for creating shots and reels or even simple videos without having to stress much on your brain or on your system's resources. You get all the basic video editing features and then some with an extensive library of templates for just about every platform. You can also export in high quality without having to worry about watermarks, which is great. Next up is HitFilm, which is one of the best multi-platform video editors available. In fact, it's one of the best free video editing softwares available for beginners. The interface again is quite easy to use and not super complex like many other advanced editors out there. While there is a paid version out there, unless you want templates and 4K exporting, the free version should be more than enough for you. Be it color correction or adding various animations or playing with keyframes or working with 3D objects, HitFilm can do everything and then some. Next up, a familiar name, Filmora from Wondershare. Now, this app is also available for Android and iOS, but the Windows app has the most features. The interface is simple because of its intuitive nature and it makes it easy for anyone to make videos with this software. In fact, it's one of the rare softwares that offers multi-layer timeline view without making it complicated. You get support for 4K resolution, the ability to do advanced keyframing, and even create green screen effects. The only caveat here is that while you get all of the features for free, there will be a watermark on the rendered video, so there's that. However, if you're willing, I would advise you to get the paid version for the software. It's a whole lot cheaper than Premiere Pro and we also made a dedicated video about it. And while watching that video, you could also grab a sweet deal on the paid license go and check the video from here. Now, if you're a fan of open source software, then you should definitely check out OpenShot. It's actually quite popular, but if you haven't tried it out till now, you sure should. The software offers pretty much what you'd expect from a good and capable video editor without charging you any money for it. The software supports all major audio and video formats and similar to Filmora, you get multi-track timeline view. The interface here can feel slightly outdated, but to be honest, that's a trade-off I'm willing to make. Moving on, if you want an advanced video editor for free, you should definitely check out Kden Live. The interface is lackluster, I agree, but apart from that, the features here are absolutely stellar. You get a full-fledged multi-track interface, support for color scopes, proxy maker for faster editing, the ability to keyframe objects, and much more. It comes preloaded with FFmpeg libraries, which allows it to not only read all formats out there, but even render in the format and configuration of your liking. Moving along, we have Lightworks, which is a paid software, but it also comes with a free variant, which is more than enough for most amateur or intermediate users. Lightworks supports a wide array of video formats, and what's more is that it even comes with support for multicam, so you can use it to edit videos of your gaming stream with your webcam overlay on top. There are also plenty of video tutorials out there, which makes the tool super easy to get into. But even without it, the interface is quite intuitive and most folks should find it relatively easy to use. Lastly, if you're looking for an advanced video editing software, which can go toe to do with the best in the business, then DaVinci Resolve is your best bet. I know it sounds crazy, but it is true that this software offers everything you'd expect for Premiere Pro for absolutely free. It offers the same professional interface with all advanced editing features. The standout point for DaVinci Resolve, basically what made its name, is the color correction tools on offer here. They are literally the best in the business and by no means is that an overstatement. In fact, a lot of creators are actually shifting from Premiere Pro and FCP to DaVinci for another reason, which is that Resolve actually makes best use of all the multiple cores and threads on your system, thus resulting in pretty much the best performance that you can get. And that's pretty much it. The download links to all of these offers can be found in the description box. And if you like the video, like it. If you love the video, then press the subscribe button. And followed by that, you'll get a bell icon. Press that, you'll get notifications for all our videos from now on. This has been Gaurang and I'll see you in the next one.